anyone have any questions or doubts anything ragul ajay ajay can you tell me the breakdown process ajay 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 are you hearing me tell me and uh, notification iw21 and uh, notification uh -huh. type m2 no mark function report and uh, enter the fl and enter the equipment and no mark function start date and time time hmm then mark function end time and the planner group may work center report board break down tick mark planner group main work center are not required okay that will come automatically that is not very important for this breakdown process okay okay inscription planner group person do not required here continue after that a breakdown tick mark hmm hmm a very important then after is the religious religion sir and the what which you will release no no which which you will release a notification sir breakdown tick mark sir for calculating breakdown period sir Hmm. Hmm. After the notification, ah, uh, clear. Uh, okay. Completed or any other thing is there? And uh, yes. And start update in equipment is mentioned to calculate the MPT error and MPT of sir. Okay. For equipment, MC JB sir. And the uh, function location MCJC for reported for MTTR MTT officer. In the entry, if they are asking breakdown, okay. Breakdown process is carried when an emergency maintenance is to be done. Example, a production is. Output are very important taking of that equipment or actually is not taken during the time break the image breakdown process is done. Breakdown process is done with the notification M2 normally. Okay, where you will enter the malfunction started, malfunction ended, breakdown tick mark mandatory. Press center, you will get the breakdown duration. Okay, and if the technical of the equipment or the FL, if the startup date is maintained here. MTTR, MTTR will get calculated. MTTR and MTBR will get calculated with the reports MCJB and MCJC for equivalent effort. Okay, this is what you need to tell. No need to tell description, plan or group works and all. No required here. Release, if you want, you can tell. Otherwise, no matter. Without release also, your MTTR, MTBR report will come. Okay, if you want, you can tell. No issues. Okay. After that, work order will be created with the work order adding material services that we didn't do immediately. We need to do and operations and doing the work again. Confirmation, take care of the secure settlement business process. Everything as you should. Don't think now there order. You need to do all the steps for the breakdown also for all process. For all the process, release confirmation settlement rule that is automatic normally that you know coming from the configuration. Okay, and then your techo and KOW settlement and business process. This is standard for any order types. Okay. Okay. Today we are going. Okay, so okay, so we had completed this and all business process. What and all general maintenance, corrective maintenance, breakdown maintenance, calibration. We need to see shutdown. Shutdown. Anyone can tell me shutdown process. Shutdown. We completed. What is shutdown process? Ragul, any clue on shutdown process with the revision? With the revision. Shutdown process is is done for any cumulative damage is to be done before the breakdown. 
Main you should tell revision. Main you should tell revision. That is the main matter. Okay. In SAP. I double thirty one. Order type schedule is selected from PM zero nine. From where? 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 From where? Order type sir. PM zero nine. Schedule type. No. Order type. No need to tell PM zero zero five zero seven. Don't no need to. Well, okay. Generally, you can tell a yeah, perfect yeah order type for breakdown like that. You can go. It's not already. You need to take PM zero one. You can take anything. Okay. You can take anything. Okay. Then, then, then first. See description. All don't tell it. In the interview, when you're telling your work order process, you should tell this. Create, release, confirmation, echo, settlement, business process. These are the steps you should tell in the interview. Okay. Don't tell really, really don't tell description, planner group, or any process. Okay. You should tell these six steps. Okay. Create, release, confirmation, echo, settlement, business process. This is what you need to tell. No need to tell planner group. Work center description and all, no need to tell because you are not going to attend as a fresher. You are going to attend three to four years experience level interview. So you should only tell this for any business process, for any of this. Are you clear, everyone? You should tell these steps from you. Along with this, along with this, your like your revision, revision, you should add breakdown, your malfunction, start date, end date, press center, malfunction, duration. That and all you should add, but these are the steps in the work. What do you need to do? Well, are you clear, Raghul? What I'm telling you, you are able to understand and everyone getting me. Don't tell this description, planner, group, work center. The tunnel is not required. Clear? Okay. Okay. Uh, tell me. Simple revision. I am doing for my shutdown process. Okay. For revision, I'll be for shutdown. I'll be creating the revision. Okay. From the revision dates will come when I enter the revision in the work order header and if I press center. From the revision, dates will get updated in the work order. That's all. After that, according to the dates, work will be done, and then you can tell the series confirmation, take a certain business process. Do. That's all. That's all. This is enough for revision. No need to tell the order type PM0102. That is all not required. Not required. Are you clear? Everyone, are you clear? No need to tell P because your project, it may be PM0. The other, we did configuration order type. We did why we did. You can create any order type for any business process. Yes or no? Yes or no? You can use any order type. You can configure. Stand, no need to tell in the interview. Standard, no need to tell in the interview. No need to tell in the interview. It can vary. Standard, you are telling yes. But even we cannot tell everything is standard. Okay, we can tell. It, it, it depends. Okay. We cannot tell it is a standard. Okay, it may differ. Okay. T code for order type is OIOA. Okay. You're telling standard PC PM09. See, here P009 is different. You're telling breakdown. Ragul, you are getting me, Rogit. Ragul, Ragul. See, you told PM09. It is not breakdown here. Sorry. Breakdown is not here at all. That's what I told. It, it may change. Okay, it may change. So no need to tell any order type. No need to tell any order type. Okay, calibration. I know PM zero six. This I know. Calibration PM zero six. Okay, breakdown. Sometimes PM zero two will come breakdown. Here they are keeping it different. Six I know. Calibration. This is what I know. Very sure. PM zero four. Yes, refurbishment. I think so. Okay, preventive. Yeah, we we don't want to buy that. That is what I am trying to tell. No need to tell any order type. If you want, you remember only calibration. If you want, because as I know, uh, calibration is PM06, as I know. Okay. It depends again project to project. Okay. It depends again project to project. No need to buy at this. Okay. 
Okay, no need to. I I don't know if we need to tell this. Okay, I am not sure. You are telling PM zero. What you told break down nine? Told nine. I, I uh, maybe I am not telling no. Okay, not telling no. Okay. See here also they didn't, they kept only four. They didn't keep all. See here, that is the reason. It may vary project to project. It may vary. Okay, you cannot tell uh, correctly. Okay, see here. See, I told right PM zero to breakdown, but see here, in the system PM zero is not breakdown. That is what I no no, no need to tell it the order type. No need to tell it order type in the entry. Okay, no need to. Uh, Ah, here. Okay. It may vary. Uh, six, I know, calibration. See, here also, for five, they kept calibration. That's what I told. It may vary project to project. Okay. Okay. So, okay. Ajay unit, you are preparing, but you need to try to give answers, Ajay. Okay. Ajay, you need to try to give still more answer. Do proper practice. Okay. Okay, so okay, so the we completed corrective, general corrective. Okay, breakdown we completed. Uh, project order, I'll tell you WBS. Okay, shutdown we completed. Now we are doing preventive maintenance. We are going to start preventive maintenance. Okay, we are going to start our, for all the process. This text is common. Create release confirmation, take over settlement. And if you want to tell, don't tell description, planner, group. Release. Okay, this and done. Release. Okay. Other things I am telling generally. Okay, description, planner group, works and done. No need to fill in the entry. Basically, if they ask, you can tell, otherwise, no need to fill. Okay. Right. So today we are going to start preventive. Okay. Before that, we in the work order, we had seen division with the breakdown process and the PRT and your F integration and uh, MM, we need to do one topic is pending. MM, okay. Uh, and uh, FI we completed, and uh, breakdown we completed, notification we completed, catalog profile we completed. Correct, this and we completed. Vendor I completed. I told you not to prepare. Okay, leave vendor warranty. And I completed face based business. I told not to prepare. No need face based. That is for personally, I'm teaching now for no required for the engine. Okay, face based and vendor don't prepare. Ragul, if you want, you can prepare, but phase base is little complex. So only till take time, you concentrate on the gender. That is what we okay. personally it is that phase base. The other is okay. So today we are going to see the reverbishment maintenance, reverbishment process. Okay. Today we are going to see the reverbishment process. So what is reverbishment process? Sorry, 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 sorry. Preventive. Preventive, we are going to see. What is preventive maintenance? Anyone can tell me what what do you mean by the word? Preventive maintenance. Sorry. Tell me, Ajay, you're telling something. Providing breakdown, sir. Very good. Preventive maintenance is carried to avoid breakdown and failure. Okay. To avoid breakdown and failure. See, in the interview, like this prevent to you breakdown if they are asking you give the definition and then start giving the answer don't go directly mainly for breakdown and preventive breakdown you can tell is emergency maintenance production stop the very important equipment or effort under breakdown then you go to the iw21 m2 notification then you go again preventive you tell this preventive maintenance is carried to avoid breakdown and failure then this will be plus for you in the interview in it is this will be present okay. yes okay preventive maintenance is carried to avoid breakdown and failure okay we don't failure to avoid breakdown and failure okay. so
Actually, preventive medicine is classified into three ways. Okay, like your time base, performance base. Okay, time base, performance base. Okay. This is two. I don't know. This normally time based performance is condition based. Okay, three. Okay. Again, it is into single cycle strategy and multiple counter. Again, it is with single cycle strategy and multiple counter. This is your uh, cali calibration that will go later. Okay. So time based, performance based, and condition based. Okay. Time based. Discuss. Okay. Performance base. Time based, performance based, and counter based. This is wrong. Okay. Time based performance is a counter. Okay. Okay. Time based, performance based, and a counter based plan. Okay. Counter based plan. We'll discuss. We'll discuss. Don't worry. Okay. Right. Okay, you tell me, Ajay. Okay, you, what you told is answer. I want to avoid breakdown or failure. Okay, I want to avoid breakdown or failure. How how you will avoid? How you will avoid the breakdown or failure? Tell me. How how you are going to avoid breakdown? You tell me. You 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 take your vehicle itself. You take your vehicle itself. Okay for maintenance. By doing periodic periodic maintenance. Periodic maintenance. Okay, if you are doing, okay, for example, take your car or your bike, okay, you will be giving service for each three months, six months. So, all the three, six months, what they will do, they will check the engine oil, correct? They will check the air pressure, okay, they will check the carburetor, okay, they will check the engine sound, they will check the light, they will check the horn, okay, and they will check the uh, battery okay and they'll check the wheel alignment right roughly i'm telling you roughly so these are the steps will be repeated anytime when you are going to do a service is it right or wrong yes or no so this is called as this is called as task list. Okay. This is called as task list because, because these are the work I am going to repeat every time when I am going to do maintenance. I can modify this. That is no issues. Why means you told repeated maintenance, for example, six months once. Okay. So each six months, I won't go and create the order. Order will be auto. Generated order or notification. Anything can be auto generated. Well, you got it. You asked me notification how can be auto generated. You given only. So when you are auto generating, order should have the operations. Okay. okay. So I don't want to go to enter manually. So in advance, I will create a task list. And I will set up in the plan. I will set up in the plan. Okay, these are the steps in the preventive maintenance. These are the steps in the preventive maintenance. These are the steps. Okay. The steps in the preventive maintenance creating task list three types are there okay three types are there creating plan three types are there okay attaching task list in the maintenance plan in the maintenance plan okay 
and then scheduling scheduling two types are there and an ip30 we'll discuss okay and then work order will be generated work order will be auto generated not manual work order will be auto when during scheduling during scheduling work order will be auto these are the steps of a preventive maintenance creating task list creating maintenance plan task task list in the maintenance plan okay and scheduling two types manual and automatic ip10 manual ip30 automatic okay ip10 and ip30 automatic okay preventive order will be generated for all okay for any preventive time based performance counter based anything these are the steps okay so now you guys are clear because when the order is auto generated i want the task what to be done i want the task to be done so this is called a task there are three type of task list okay general task list okay and then equipment task list Default task list. These are the T type of task list. Okay. No big differences. Nearly the same. T code IA05. Okay. IA01 and IA11. Report IA09. Report IA09. And table uh, PLPO, PLKO. Okay. Table we are not discussing nowadays. Please practice tables also. PLKO task list header PLKO and PLPO task list operations PLPO and first PLKO okay PLKO and PLPO okay these are the tables for task list table for task list General equipment default task list IA 0501 for any list very very important okay status sir what is I I zero nine IA zero nine report IA 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 typing error okay so status and usage mandated before this is very important. If you are not maintaining four for any task list in the PA model, you will get error. You will get error. So this four status is mandatory. Go to my Excel. It is given very, very clearly. You can see here. Okay. Read everything. It's given very detailed. Okay. You can read very clearly. Okay. We will go. We will go anyhow. Okay. So these are the task list report. Okay. Header status. Okay. So we'll discuss that. Okay, we'll discuss that. Yeah, there is a small configuration for the task list. Okay, we'll go to the task list. Okay. IA05. Okay, IA05. For this task list, we have a small configuration. For the task list, we have a small configuration. Okay, task list profile. This profile. Small, very small configuration. I think we see it. I don't know the keyword for the task list profile. Okay, so we have small configuration under this. Okay, and I forgot to tell you 
task list and the maintenance plan are the master data. Last two master data. We had completed master data. What are all master data completed, Ajay? Ajay, what are all master data completed first? Ajay. Work center, class and static, um, equipment, functional location, equipment, um, bomb, um, PRT, measuring unit and measuring documents, sir. Measuring document is not a task list, a master data. Okay. Measuring document is not a master data. Okay. Other things are good. The last two are the, the task list and the maintenance plan. Last two master data. Okay. Last two master data. Okay. Task list and the plan you can see in the top. Again, permit is a master data. Okay. Small, small things are there. Okay, so we are dealing with task list and plan. This central work center classification is well warm. Okay, machining point are completed. Okay, now we are doing this. This is completed. This is completed. Okay, permit we completed. Catalog profile remote notification completed. So strategy we are going to see now. So these two are the last two master okay, task list. So this is a master data. So see here master data and PM and CS. No, come down. See here task list is here. Okay, so open the second one. Task list, second, third or fourth. Go to general data. No, close it. Control data here. This is a configuration for the task list. This we already did in the work order. Okay, open PM0. It is nothing but your calculation key and your unit of hours for the operation and your MM duration. This and all we did in the work order. Okay, see here usage and status and usage. Okay, so this is your calculation key, calculate duration, zero hours. This is your operation. So from here it will come. Okay, so now go here, put PM01. Okay, because this will get copied. Okay, press enter. Okay, give the description. Okay, so. Okay. Uh, okay, I am doing now for uh, Virat bike. Okay, I am doing for Virat bike and then car. Or. Uh, bike itself, okay. Bike two bike is there. He's having okay. Yamaha and I don't know the new bike name. My son knows. Okay, Yamaha and uh, what you can tell. Any bike name, sir? Hero. Okay, Yamaha and a Hero. Okay, but both are bike. Both are bike. So first time creating for the Yamaha bike. Okay. Yamaha bike service task list. Okay, you can see here general task list. Give the planner group. Okay, give the work center. This central, you know. I told you usage status. Why? Usage is for your PM module. Usage is for your PM module. Okay, plan to maintenance module. You, that is what I told. This is mandatory. If you use other things, you may not use this task list for the PM module. It may throw error. So mandatory for okay. Status also mandatory for because. Status is ready. My task list ready. General. Okay, release general. So this is mandatory. Don't forget. For any task list in the PM mode. Okay. Planner group you can add. Okay. Uh, that one you can press center. So click the operation button at the top. Click the operation button at the top. It is nothing but an operation. Go to your Excel. Copy. Engine oil, air pressure, wheel alignment, calibration, everything. The work I'm going to do, engine oil, air pressure, engine sound, light, horn, battery check, wheel alignment, and uh, what is this? Carburetor checking. Okay. So put your number of resources and hours. This and we did in the work order. Same. Okay. This and we did in the work order. Okay. And your calculation key, your calculation key, your operation. And this hours came from the profile. Okay, came from the. Otherwise, you need to enter manually. That's all. If you are trading separately, you need to enter manually. See here. A zero five. Right. If I am not giving the profile, I am keeping profile enter entry empty. Okay, keep it enter. Okay. So give here 
C. Status is empty. I need to enter manually. Usage is empty. I need to enter manually. Go to operation. See? It's not there. Plus, I didn't enter the task list profile. Since I entered the task list profile, this came clear, right? Your hours and your calculation key, your operation code is coming from the task list profile. Small configuration. So this SPR path also kept here. Okay, it is there. Okay, and then operations, you know, okay, these are the operations and your resources by the calculation key work you get calculated, press enter. Okay, so okay. Okay, like this you can enter here and work will get calculated. And if, if you want to add materials, click the component button. Okay, select the line, click component. Okay, go and add your materials. Okay, go and add your materials. Okay, this issue with some other material. Okay. This is Anna. Huh? What category? What equipment here? What equipment here? I didn't understand what it really. Okay. Okay. So material quantity, how much you want you can add. What is this button? Anyone can tell me. Long, long ago, very long ago, we came this. Your bomb attachment. Okay. If you are doing for your sorry not material bomb equipment or fl is having bomb equipment bomb be fl bomb not construction type i'm telling this is equipment at fl bomb you can take from the component okay but this is general task is here in equipment we'll see that okay and add more materials okay Go to the operation, okay. And if you want to add services, you keep PM03 that we didn't do, we'll do it later. Services, MM deletion, okay. So this and all, you will get the issue as a problem because we didn't maintain the control key yet. We didn't maintain the cost element yet. Okay, so you will get some issues here. Report for task list IA09. So this you will get the service number. OK, we didn't do services. We'll discuss later. OK, I told I we need to do the implementation of so that we'll discuss.
and a group. This group. Indeed. Press center. Again, you can add your PRT, equipment PRT if you need. Okay, you can add your equipment PRT that we already know. Okay, so equipment PRT or document PRT you can add here. Okay, category B. Category, 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 equipment category. P P category we need, okay. So go with the just I'm showing. Because only P it will take. What is this? Category P. Enter. Okay, back and pick. Okay. Just I'm showing, okay. So, in what is the issue? It's not having the PHF, okay. Execute. Let take this control YC. Come here. Put okay, here. Press center. Okay. Like this, you can add your PRT. Dark PRT also you can add. Okay. Like you can add your. Okay. Document CV01. Document PRT you can add. Okay. This is how to create a task list. So anyone have any questions? What is task list? Why we are creating any any questions or any doubts? Ajay Ravel with any questions or any doubts. Okay, save it. You can see the group. This is the group counter. Save it. Okay, go to report. A09. Go with created on date. See, there are three paper process I told. Function location, equipment, and gender. Okay, so see here. Created on date, right? Is the system date? Sixteen seven. Oh, today date only. Okay, fine. Okay. So go with create on date. Okay, we created a gentle, but we'll give all the okay. So we'll get only what we created, right? Someone had created a key put us list. Someone. Okay. Okay, this is what we created. Okay. Yes. Now, next I want to create for hero bike. We created by we created for Yamaha. Now I want to create for hero. But both are for bike, right? So bike is group, okay? And Yamaha and hero are the counter group counter. See here, group counter. So group is one at four for bike. This is counters. So again, go to A05. The center. Give the same group or not for. Give the profile. Press center. Already group under one is there. It's for Yamaha. I am doing for the next. New entry. See a counter two. This is called group and group counter. Clear on the group and group counter. Any questions?
Okay. So give the description hero bike. Okay. Okay. Hero. Where it is. Sir, group counter will take automatically. Automatically. Group counter will take automatically. System, from system, there is no number ranges also. Only group will have number ranges. Group counter will not have number ranges also. Group counter will not have number ranges also. See here. Number ranges for general task list means it is the group only, not the counter. Clear? Okay, I don't know whether this is to be required. Okay, I don't know. If you want, you can set up the numbers. It is running number now, or not? Okay, is a running number now? Okay, okay. So uh, give this and all. Okay, I am not doing everything here because same. Only I want to show this counter. Go to operation. Add your task list. That's all. Add your uh, operations. Okay. Again, you if you want to add your services, PRP, material, services, external, okay, and come to that. You can come and see. Just I'm coming. No need to come here. You can save here. Do you want to save the group? Yes. Okay. Now go to IA09. Just refresh. So this is what task list. This is how to create a task list. Sir, what is that the group type? type? Three type of groups. Three type of task list. Function location, and general. A for general. A for general. Okay. And E for equipment. E for tasks. These are the three we are going to use. Only these three. Only these three. General equipment task list, general task list, and A for task list. Others don't worry because that will be used for the PP. Because in the PP module also, they will create task list, but they won't use the word task list. They will use the word as routing. They will use the word as task list means routing in the PP module. Task list means routing in the PP module. Just information I'm telling, okay? The PP module, task list means, they are also creating task list, but they won't create, okay? So that they will tell us routing. Routing means in the PP module, it is task list, okay? The PP module, they will tell us routing okay and your header your header your header data will change your pp for pp i'm telling okay this may be different number the usage may be something okay but will not be four maybe here one but that's not our scope i'm just telling you okay that the, the t code they are not this t code it will be different t code also not this t code that is not our requirement at all okay The type we need to select or it will take automatically, sir. If we go and do in uh, general task uh, list, it will take automatically or we should select the type. You don't want to select according to the decode, it will take automatically. According to this, automatically type will come. Got it? If IA05 gender task is only IA01 equipment, no, your question I got you. I got you. Okay. Like in the notification, we are giving M1, but here in a IA05, you can create general only. For general, it will take automatically. General, what it will come? Maybe A, right? A, yeah, A, it will take automatically. No need to enter. It will come default. It will come default. Okay. Go to tables. Use tables. We didn't touch tables very long ago. We need to use tables also. We also forget tables, right? We didn't touch it. Control F, create it all. Okay, new to delete.
okay you can see the number of entries we created two four four what we created okay someone is creating along with this we didn't create right this one is coming but there it was not there so someone is doing along with this it's coming here Why? I also don't know what is this entry. Okay, leave it. This is not our matter. Topic. Okay, leave it. But it should. Oh, okay, okay. This is equipment task list. Okay, this IA zero for equipment. So you are not getting the uh, other module. So someone in the back end. See, they are creating routing coming clear PP. You leave it. Don't 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 break your head here. That is for the PP model. Leave it. Okay. If you want to see here, it will be different. Okay, leave it. This is not our matter. Okay, so now the task list created general task list. Next is equipment task list. Okay, so equipment task list. I am taking a E zero one. I am giving the T code here. Okay, when I press enter, I am getting a field only one field. Equipment I cannot enter multiple equipments. In the means for a specific buy. Okay, any new buy. Company or anything you want, you can tell. For example, new bike uh, ambassador. Example, okay. Ambassador new bike at K means this bike I will create a equipment. And the task list I am going to use here can be used only for this single equipment. This task list can be used for only one single equipment. Are you clear what I am trying to tell? For example, you brought that bike from some foreign okay so the task the work you are going to do for that task list is for only for that one equipment okay if even if you try to use for other equipments you cannot use see here see here for only one single particular equipment what number you are entering here for this keep it only you can use this task list okay so i'll take some equipment from here okay so go back equipment by equipment list give the category m execute take any equipment okay take any equipment uh, maybe this one View the profile, press enter. So this 48 is can be used for only one equipment. Even if you try, you cannot use for other objects. Okay. So government give the planner group. Okay. And go to the operation entry. Okay. Press enter. Okay. Give the operation. This is what the this is what the Equipment task list. So this task list can be used for only this equipment, even if you try. You cannot use for other objects. That is called general task equipment task list. And add whatever you want components, PRP, bomb, bomb. If your equipment is having equipment bomb, you can get from here. Yes, it is there. Material is there, but it is not having the spare parts. Okay. Equipment is having the construction type, but the, the construction type is not having the bomb. Okay. So you are not getting otherwise it will come from the construction type. It is here, but this is not having the structure. It is issue. See, it is not having your material bomb is there, but it is not in the structure. Okay. If it is there, you can take from here. Okay, you can take from here. So this is about the 
equipment task list. Does anyone have any questions on the equipment task list? Why are you creating? Clear, clear on that. What I am trying to create? Are you guys clear? Clear, sir. Clear. Ajay, what is going on? Girlfriend is calling. Ajay. Speak to me, sir. You think I am your girlfriend, sir? Speak to me. Control F, create and press center. New to the date. Check number of entries. It should have increased. Enter, press F8. You can see what we created the next one. We created only one, right? Who, are, who is doing the backend, man? Rogit, are you doing? <laughs> Who is Rogi Karajay? When I did sir. Yesterday. I okay. 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 So this is about the equipment. Since FL task list only T code will change. You are going to give the FL here. Okay. You are going to give the FL here. I eleven. Okay. So you will be creating for the FL here. Okay. You can take any FL. Okay, go back. Go with the FL. Okay, so take plant. Zoot. Okay. Take any FL. That's all. Profile. Press enter. Give the description and all everything. Okay, go to operation. See your FL number name. Okay. Give the operations. Calculate work. Press enter. Mm. Tell me. Why not? Why I should not do preventive for FL? I should not do preventive maintenance for the function location. How you hmm? take your operation? For what purpose you take this? My total company, my, my company, I want to do. Uh, license, electrical license, or boiler license, or uh, some certificate to be issued from the government each year. I'll create a preventive order will generate from the order. I'll come to know. Okay, we need to get this license renewed. Example: R cooling system. Okay, cooling system. Ten, ten pumps are there. Cooling system. Ten pumps are there. Ten pumps and motors. I want to do a yearly maintenance, yearly inspection. I'll create at the FL level. General, general inspection or any worn out and anything. I don't want to do each pump voice. I want to do on the cooling system, total system. I want to do a yearly inspection. By belt check, abnormal sound check, vibration check, common, full, full system. The inlet, the cooling system, inlet line check, outlet line check, temperature check, uh, belt each motor and pump with the belt check, the bearing check. Current check, cable inspection, your base inspection. Base means it will be with the nut and bolt, right? Whether the base is correct, vibration, like that, still, etc. General inspection. I don't want to create one each motor wise, each, each pump wise. I want to do common yearly one. I can do, right? Anything are like yearly government approvals. Like you are uh, even for, for your company, you wanted to pay your best company, right? Pre create a general maintenance order. Each month order will be generated. It will remember you. Go and pay, do the payment for the best company. Why not? I can create a preventive maintenance. Preventive order for it. Yes, sir. No. I may forget, sir. I will create a preventive order and go. Each month order will generate. Come on, go and go the, pay the best company. Why not? It is also part of my maintenance. Paying. Got it? What I'm telling? Okay, okay. Like that, I can do anything. Like that, even this cooling system, like this, and the generator is there. Generator two years once I want to do service. Okay. So I'll create an order for two years once. Two years once the order will be generated because we will forget everything. If we create an order, automatically when the second year is coming, the order will generate. Do maintenance for generator. Done. All the generators. Five generators, even if you have 10 generators, what I will do, I'll split it. Five for one year, next year five. 
so when this year 2024 this year it will give the five generators do inspection or service next year it will come for the next 2025 so this will be repeated again what will happen next year 22 so year 1 to 10 generator number 1 to 5 year generator number 5 to 10 okay so again the next year what will happen 1 to 5 will start again the next year 5 to 10 will come so yearly once 5 5 generator inspection i am doing so i don't want to remember this system will generate the order clear now like this why not fl my my inspection central i will put preventive maintenance that is what preventive right avoiding breakdown inspection i'll do with preventive whatever i forget i'll create a preventive order and go that's it orders will be generated with orders i'll be doing all my inspection everything will be done accordingly i don't want to remember i don't want to write in the excel or word file or pdf automatically system will generate my orders as per the dates i am putting Clear? No, good question. That's what I'm giving the explanation. Okay. So this is what FL give your description whatever you want. Okay. You add your services component, PRT, and everything, whatever you want, you can add it. Presenter. Okay. And save it. Okay. Go to the table. I didn't use table at all, sir. You should have remembered me. I also did. Here, PLP and table, press enter. Control it on. Right, enter. Execute. So now you will get. Execute. So F we created P. P is your F 27. Okay. Display. Enter. Okay. Just I will show how the order is generated. Okay. Next class we are going to see the plan. IP 41, IP 42, IP 43. Single cycle. Strategy. Multiple control. Okay. I am going to IP41. So I'll give, give tell a small scenario. Three months so I want the maintenance. Okay. Three months repeated. Okay. Three months repeated. I want to do the maintenance. So I'm creating a plan, single cycle plan, IP41. I'll close this. Don't worry. Only two minutes. Okay. So take your order. Okay. Press enter. Give the description. Okay. And three months. Okay. Take any equipment for now. Press enter. Equipment is now there. Take some equipment. Press enter. This will do next slide. Just time touching. Okay. Just time showing how the order will be generated. Okay. Press enter. Okay. Yeah. Come down. Go up three months. You are given this. We'll see tomorrow. Caller and scheduling period. We'll see tomorrow. Okay, come down. Take your task list. What we created just now. Go in here. Generate task list. Create it on. Create it on today. Okay, execute. Take your general. Okay, for hero task list, I'm doing hero bike. Right, it's a quarterly maintenance. Save it. Schedule IP10 dates. I forgot to tell you. Preventive. Dates are very critical. Very, very critical. In preventive. Because like in the work order, you are changing date here. You cannot change. Okay. Dates and measurement documents. Every date and every measurement document is important. One date, if you change somewhere, it will totally change your preventive. On that plan, one plan I'm telling. So you should be very cautious. In the first you write this. Dates are very, very critical and measurement documents because with the dates only your preventive will play. Okay. So you should be very sure of the dates. Press center. Go to IP10, scheduling, press center, start, press center, select the line, click release, call date will be disappeared, save it, order generated. This is how the order is generated and prevented. I'll give you this continue tomorrow. You can see the order number here. Sir, where, where we can do that order generated? 
tomorrow we'll see sir just type ip10 and ip ip30 ip10 i will do tomorrow you don't worry just i show you how the order is generating ip10 ip10 and ip30 ip10 and ip30 we'll discuss tomorrow just i show you how to create the order scheduling ip10 and ip30 we'll discuss tomorrow we didn't touch a plan at all what is why you are creating that all we need to discuss okay don't worry just i show you you can see in the planning for your plan number call number okay created on date and all so this is your preventive order okay okay any questions for today any questions for today anything virat are you preparing virat and ajay virat virat are you preparing no sound yes sir no sir tell me some word hmm yes sir pre 